you are allowed to breathe. Try to stay relaxed when you're skiing. You can see the difference between somebody who looks quite calm and placed and letting the skis work and somebody who's turned into Mr. or Mrs. Viagra and gone super stiff. Now, I'm not talking about going super floppy and losing any form. You do need to hold yourself and stay in a good position, but don't go stiff. Even though I'm nicely relaxed, I'm not losing good form. My core can be engaged and I can have some tension through the muscles, but it's not blocking any potential movement. Don't mistake being relaxed with getting lazy. The more supple and loose you can be, the better your balance will work. The skyscrapers that you get in Japan, they've actually worked out that if they put a little bit of suspension through there, when there are earthquakes, the actual whole building will move and stay upright. If they were completely solid and rigid, they will crumble, all the vibrations will go straight through them and they'll collapse. And that's exactly like you when you're skiing down a slope. There's thousands of little micro bumps, some big, some small, and as the turns are changing, you're in different positions and different balance. So if you start to go stiff and rigid and try and hold a position, every little micro bump that you ski over is gonna try and throw you out of balance. Your body is the suspension. It has to be free from tension so it can absorb everything coming up through your feet. If you can also keep breathing, it's gonna make a huge difference. A great way of thinking of it is as the turn starts, you could maybe breathe in, and as you're finishing the turn, breathe out. And it should encourage you to keep on getting this oxygen through your body. If you're getting that burning kind of thighs, quite often it's because there's not enough oxygen to take away that acid. So make sure you're breathing nicely, staying relaxed and calm. And you see this all the way through the levels of skiing. You see even the top skiers, the best World Cup racers on the planet are going stiff and skiing tense. It doesn't work as well. Stay relaxed, stay supple. Skiing terrain that is pushing your limit will often create tension. Try and be aware of it building. Before you head off, a couple of good deep breaths before starting the run will definitely help. Another trigger can be the idea of building performance. Even if you're really trying to lift your game, you don't need to turn into a Michelangelo statue. If your knuckles are almost going white through gripping the poles, you're probably building up tension in your arms. This will transfer into your shoulders, back and throughout the rest of the body. Tension will definitely block some of the essential movements you need to make. Keep breathing, stay in a comfortable position, don't go too tight. The more relaxed you can stay, the better your balance is going to work. Thank you.